Hello, welcome to Aeroshift channel. In this short video, I'm going to uh, show you how to access the test cases that are in the Code Astro Solver, which have been validated uh, through the Salomon Mecca 2019 software. So if you're not familiar, uh, there are plenty of uh, test cases available in the Code Astro Solver that you can access and uh, straight away run it. And then you can use that as a template for running any other problems. So uh, I'll show you first as to where the documentation is for all these uh, solvers so if you go to code astral website and uh, go to the documentation section select the version that you are using and here the validation is what uh, we are looking at so there are all if you click on test cases by name it will list you all the test cases but uh, it, to get an introduction to what how they are numbered you can look at this document which is this so this document tells you uh, how those doc, uh, the test cases are numbered. So the coding of the is, is used by seven characters. So the first four letters indicate what type of analysis it is, and then the, use the sequence number for uh, the different problems. So I'm going to show you select one problem, select one uh, test case, and show you how to access it in the Salama Mecca and run it. So that uh, if you want to run any other problem, you should be able to run it. So I'm choosing this problem, which I will access it in the Salama Mecca. So the way to do this is uh, go to the Salama Mecca, go to the Aster Study, use the Operations Import Test Case option. Type in the case that you want to select and click OK. That will import the, the test case. It generally will give uh, or might give a warning about the output file name because uh, the output file is not defined, whereas the input file is already there. So this particular problem, it has not given any warning because the output defined is just the table rather than writing to any other output. So there is no warning here but in other problems you might have an error so you import the case and you may have to define the output file if it is if it is required if it gives an error then you can save the file and then go to run it so I'm gonna just save it here and then go to the history view define some high worry So as you can see here, there is no output file that is being generated for this particular run. So it, it, it's just comparing the results. So that file successfully runs and you have the, the message file that you can read through to uh, generate. So this is how you can access any other test case that are that is available within within the code aster and uh, you can edit or use the input file that is imported because the the com file that has been imported here so you can use these commands for uh, for uh, you for using in other problems and uh, running them so i'm going to make uh, a few videos uh, using different uh, type of different test cases and solving them and explaining the output and also the input and hopefully comparing them with a hand calculations or a classical solutions where we can uh, if you want to see any particular test case to be investigated or made a video upon please uh, leave a comment then i will try to look at uh, that particular test case thanks for watching